Everybody smile! Welcome back to another one. In this video, I'm gonna be talking about a strategy that I use very often. I talked about it in the past, but I'm bringing it back up again for all the new people that's here. And I'm putting a name to it this time. But before we get too far into the video, I just wanna say I hope that everybody had a wonderful Christmas yesterday. I enjoyed myself. I hope everybody just had a good time with their family or even if you wasn't with your family, I just hope that you enjoyed it. And I got to give a special, special shout out to one of my favorite groups, a group that is in my top five and has been in my top five for a long time, Hometown Entertainment. A lot of y'all probably already seen it on Facebook, but he has a really big giveaway going on right now. And I wanted to tell all y'all about it. So please go to his Facebook page and check out the giveaway if you want to enter. It's a $25,000 giveaway. And if you don't play with Hometown, make an account. And if you make an account with them, please, please tell them that you came from the Gambling Center on YouTube. You might get special privileges. Who knows? But let's get into the video. Okay, so this right here is a $50 load. I accidentally shot a five cent bullet when I was trying to swipe my screen down to start screen recording. Okay, so like I said, in the past, I've talked about this, but now I'm putting a name to it. This is what I call the boss hunt. When I tell myself I'm going on a boss hunt, it means that when I sign on, I'm going to not spend no money on the main stage or I'm going to spend just a little bit of money on the main stage. So right here, I think I played my money down to like $40 and I told myself I was going to stop regardless and wait for the genie to come out. And the reason why I like to do this often is because a lot of times it doesn't take long for the boss to go. And this has helped me win money a lot of times. So that's why I'm bringing it to y'all. I call this the boss hunt, and you should try it out for yourself.
Now, what is going to be hard to some people about a boss hunt is that it does require some patience. Going through that main stage, you're going to be tempted to like shoot your money yourself to try stuff. That's why I do give myself some cushion sometimes. Like maybe I try $10. In this nature. situation, I was cool to try 20 because when I signed on, I had 60 So $40 was good enough for me. But it just all depends on how much money I load. If I don't have that much money, like say if I had 35 when I got on, I probably wouldn't have spent no money at all because even though the boss can go early you still want to allow yourself a good amount of money just in case the boss does take a little longer to go so that's what it's all about but i just love going for the bosses because i know the money that it can bring And we all play this game and we all know how it goes. That's why I like to stress I'm not guaranteeing nothing. Like, of course, you know that you can play the boss and it might not go at all. But I'm just saying it's a good strategy to try out sometimes here and there. I'm not saying you got to do it every time. I don't do it every time. But it is something that works out for me a lot of times. The important thing is just being patient. I know it's going to be hard. Just try to keep yourself distracted with something until the boss stage comes on. If you're looking at the screen, watching all the stuff go across the screen, you're going to be tempted to tap at something. I know how it is because you're just going to be curious if it's going to die or not. Another wonderful day. And as y'all can see right here, I have been working on my first $5 hit. It still hasn't happened for me and it's very frustrating, but I've been trying it. Hopefully when it does happen, I do catch it on recording. I'm going to try my best to, but a lot of times I play, I don't record, but I'm going to try my best to catch it on recording for y'all. I hope that y'all have enjoyed this video. I know that we all just trying to get to the money. So that's why I just like to kind of bring what I do to my YouTube channel to show y'all so that hopefully y'all can try it and hopefully it works out for y'all. But please, please like the video and subscribe to the channel if you're not already. Go check out Hometown Entertainment. If you're not playing with Hometown Entertainment, then you're missing out. Like I said, they're in my top five and they have been for a long time now. So go check them out. The link to that Facebook page is in the description section. And like I said, if you sign up with them and make an account, just let them know that you came from the Gambling Center on YouTube because you might get special privileges. You never know. But I appreciate all of y'all. Stay tuned for the next video.